Yo, what's going on, people? Now, I'm pretty sure you guys know about the case with Fabulous and his girl, Emily B. And uh, I might do a separate video on this, but I want to talk about this bitch here. Now, for those who don't know about her, I think her name is Lovely T.I. or Lovely T. She loves sipping tea. I don't know. She's just a, 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 what's her name? Wendy Williams wannabe with her multiple ring necks. She looks like, 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 like Jacob the Jeweler loaned her some rings around her necks. I, I can't stand this bitch. Um, I think, I think, uh, Jason Black went in on her once, you know, but amidst the whole fabulous thing, she's trying to paint fabulous as this crazed monster, right? Now, I'm not saying that fabulous should have hit her, um, Emily B. I'm not saying that. Like I always say, I don't agree with domestic violence, but I understand it. Sometimes, because some women can drive you up the wall, okay? But I don't agree that it's the way to handle the situation, especially in America, where women can pop off their mouths and get away with shit, okay? It's not worth it for men, because you'll get caught up in the system. But she's trying to paint Fabulous as this crazy, deranged guy talking about how he disrespects Emily B because he doesn't claim her and he doesn't show up in public with her. You see, I cannot understand the the flawed mental capacity of most females. Okay? And I need to do a video on that. I keep saying I'm going to do a video on how a lot of females, they get their shine and they get their... They're their status from latching on to certain men. That's how a lot of them are known. So they force you to show up in public with them. Now, there must be a reason why Fabulous didn't want to show up in public with, his, with Emily B too much. He, he has taken pictures with her, but not too much. And I understand why, because what happens is a lot of people don't like to put their lives out there. When I say people, I'm talking celebrities. Look at Chris Brown. He put his shit out there with Karuchi. Now, everybody knows their business. He made Karuchi into what she is. And I don't think any male celebrity should have his wife or his girlfriend out there on the red carpets exposing her to the industry. Look at what happened to Nas and Carmen. A whole bunch of industry guys fucked Carmen. Why did that happen? Because Nas had her around the industry. But that's because a lot of women use these guys to get industry connects. And that's what she's, this bitch here is, is trying to um, promote. Saying that Fabulous doesn't care about his girl because he didn't, he didn't claim her and he didn't bring her in public and shit like this. The dude is a low-key guy. So now she's insinuating that he must have been beating her, you know, behind the scenes and in the house. That's why he didn't want to. He didn't want um to put his life out there, and if 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 he's behaving like that on camera, because we've all seen the TMZ new video, she's saying that if he's behaving like that in on the camera, you can just imagine how he's behaving behind the scenes. I don't think that's true. I, I don't. I don't. I don't think that that makes sense. Obviously, the guy was upset about something. Now, I'd like to touch on something else. She's insinuating that he isolated her from her father and stuff like that. And even in the comment sections, her stupid fans are are, are insinuating this too. Now. In the video, he asks her, what is this guy doing here? Um, referring to her father. And she's like, that's my dad. You know? But she, the voice that she said it in, Emily B, it, 
she sounded she sounded kind of scared and of course she would be scared because fabulous is upset women know that men are more powerful than them physically so they're going to get upset when they're going to get scared when these men get upset now this guy has a right to ask what is he doing here because it's fabulous's house it's not emily's house it's fabulous house i think and he has a right to not want her father there maybe um fabulous and the father doesn't have a good relationship it's just like with with a lot of um daughter-in-laws and mother-in-laws they don't have good relationships they don't like each other it's the same thing here or it could be the same thing here obviously they probably don't like each other the father doesn't like fabulous fabulous doesn't like the father shit happens it it doesn't have to be a case where fabulous was treating the da- the daughter bad it could have been but it doesn't have to be and irrespective of the of the situation whether he was treating her bad or not for the father to not like him it's fabulous's house he doesn't want he doesn't have to um allow the father to come there it's his house now if emily knows that she's in an uncomfortable situation she should have left everybody knows 911 so why did she stay with him all this time the relationship could not have been that bad something happened to trigger this man off no i'm not saying he should have beat her that's not what i'm saying but this bitch here let's take it back to this bitch because i'm just countering what she said is on here trying to tend to paint a picture of the man as being some monster and you know because he's so he he's he's lying because he put out this persona as if he's so such a quiet guy bitch you don't know the guy little mo spoke on it little mo knows him you don't know him you're just a bitch online on 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 fucking youtube trying to be wendy williams you don't know this guy Bill Cosby was right. The internet has given some stupid people a loud voice to just talk shit. Everybody thinks they're of some kind of philosopher. Everybody thinks they know shit. And I personally think a lot of these celebrities should start suing a lot of you guys here on YouTube for popping off your mouth hiding behind uh well freedom of speech. I can't stand this bitch. She knows nothing. All she does is read shit on the internet and regurgitate what what TMZ or what other people says. She she doesn't know shit. She doesn't know these people she's talking about. Now I'm not saying that Fabulous should have hit the girl. But he's in the industry. He knows the industry. There's a reason why he doesn't want to bring her around the industry. because he knows that you bring your girl around the industry she's going to fuck niggas that's number 1 and number 2 a lot of these females try to use these guys to climb up the ladder to get industry connects Karuchi would have would have wouldn't have been anything if she wasn't fucking Chris Brown because some of you females are parasites if the man hit the girl just just deal with that you're trying to dig into his past and all, all of this shit you, that's why i keep saying the black woman is the enemy of the black man because they do everything the white man does who calls you boy the black man what you doing around here boy who parrots that black women they like to call men boys who likes to 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 um to 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 put men in bondage black men in bondage the white men who does the same thing black women everything they run and they call the cops i have to do a video about that too ever since the Trayvon Martin case who's been going into to 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 to, to the past of these 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 black men getting shot digging up their past and all this shit white men no no who's doing that this bitch you don't know what happened in that home are you a fly on the wall in their home bitch shut the fuck up 